Friday, April 12th, and I'm Alex Mahadavan, here to report the daily headlines. A gas main break closes Osprey Avenue. A gas main break closed one square mile at the intersection of Osprey and Grove Street late this morning. A company was installing a new natural gas main when the crew hit a water main line. The pressure from the water caused a gas main to break. At least 10 homes in the area were evacuated. Southside Elementary School students were evacuated to Brookside Middle School. Authorities are in search of a former Longboat Key pharmacy owner. Authorities have A.J. Patel on charges of filling prescriptions as part of a drug trafficking operation. Patel operated three pharmacies in Manatee County, including the former medicine shop, which was located at the center shops on Longboat. Authorities suspect Patel could have fled the country. Anyone with information should contact the Manatee County Sheriff's Office at 747-3011, extension 2560. This weekend's best bets include two Siesta Key events, a Longboat Key tennis tournament, and a cigar lover's feast. The Sarasota Open serves up a handful of the world's most elite players to Longboat Key this weekend. Watch veterans of the sport, as well as up-and-comers, this Saturday at the Longboat Key Club's tennis gardens. And Siesta Key is booked this weekend with art and sand volleyball action with the annual Siesta Fiesta Art Festival and the Fiesta of Siesta Collegiate Volleyball Tournament. Both take place Saturday and Sunday. And tonight from 6 to 9 at the Sarasota Polo Club, cigar lovers can rejoice in the Beast Feast. The event is sponsored by the Kiwanis Club of Lakewood Ranch and features fine foods, cigars, liquors, and sweets. This week's Popcorn Bob Movie Magic Reviews are in. This week, Popcorn Bob reviews No 2013, 56 Up, and Tyler Perry's Temptation. Bob says No 2013 is a riveting portrayal of the intrigue behind the 1988 unseating of Chilean dictator Augusto Pinochet. He says 56 Up is a brilliant long-term work documenting British people from the age of seven every seven years to their current age of 56. Finally, Bob says Tyler Perry's film Temptation is a flop. He says it's some of the poorest scripting and acting you will ever see. That's all for today's daily headlines. For more community and breaking news, go online to yourobserver.com daily and pick up a copy of the Longboat, Sarasota, and East County Observer and the Pelican Press. You, your neighbors, your neighborhood.